Uh, how I felt when I fell behind my mortgage uh, payments. I felt terrible, overwhelmed, because um, it didn't help when I got involved in a fraudulent company that really put me behind on my payments. And when I thought I was going to lose my house, I was devastated. Once they, re they knew the story about how I got hooked up with this fraudulent company, they were very understanding and they worked really hard uh, trying to undo all the damage that this other company did, um, which was a big help. I told them what happened and they were really understanding and uh, um, they left me with a feeling that uh, things were going to get better. And they did. They just instilled confidence in that they, they and I went on the law site, uh, I went on their website and, and looked at uh, um, the credentials and stuff. And there was always two, three people that were in touch with me. I didn't know until the day of the auction whether or not I would be waking up to see people um, in the yard ready to buy my house. Um, but Lipton worked really hard and and <clears throat> the auction was canceled but they didn't tell Lipton or me about it. Um, but they, they had been working very hard to, to try to ensure that I would not lose the house and they did I'm still here. Yeah I would record them recommend them to a friend. Hopefully no one will ever need the services that I know. But if they did, yeah, I would I'd tell them to go to Lipton and, uh, and talk to them about their problems. They treated me as an individual. Um, you, you felt like they were look, personally looking after you and that you weren't just a, uh, another Oh, we got this guy on the hooks and it's like we'll just simply do what we have to do and move on to the next one. In fact, they even call me every now and then now to see how I'm doing. Because you, you know that they, they weren't there to make big bucks off you. They were there to try to make sure that you stayed in your home. And uh, that is very important.